today I wanted to do a video of what I do with my preschooler, my three-year-old. We keep it pretty simple, very short lesson. Um, we're just really concentrating on ABC. She gets numbers pretty easily, but bickering has been crazy this week. <sighs> All right, crisis averted. Um, the main things I use for preschool is a notebook. This is Marley's notebook. It's just a wide ruled notebook because I couldn't find the ones that had the blank at the top and the uh, line pages at the bottom. I don't know. Mama just didn't have it. So that is my main thing that I use. That and my the MoFat Girls printables on Teachers Pay Teachers. Uh, just look up the MoFat Girls and she has uh, monthly preschool. So now we're on October. So everything's like pumpkins and um, autumn things. And it takes her through like we did in A, B, C, D into September, maybe. And then E, F, G, something like that. But she splits up the ABCs throughout the uh, year. And I love theme work, so I love that it's monthly, seasonal uh, worksheet. And another thing that we do maybe once a week is this alphabet fun schooling journal from Thinking Tree Books. And this is just very, after we've learned the letter, and then we, I'll turn it around and show you. But, I, after we learn the letter, so usually on Fridays, we will color this, and I will work with her and color it with her. And then she does some tracing exercises. She traces her letters, she writes her letters, and then we talk about and trace with our finger the letter down here. So we are finishing up E this hopefully today because I'm a little behind. So I'd like to finish E today and we're going to start on F. So we're going to do this page and move on to F. So I really like these. I like thinking tree books. I love the design. I love the concept. So after she's done then it kind of does has fun things at the back, fun tracing practices, some line pages, some comic writing, doodling kind of thing. Is that it? I think that's, yeah, just a whole bunch of this page. Yeah. So yeah, I'm going to add that to that. Yeah, so that is my main thing for my, make it, my whatever child it is, Marley. And I'm going to show you a little bit more of our notebook and her working on it. So, I'll show you what we've done so far. We haven't done too much. She just doodles when we, I do, I read our read alouds and your, her sisters are doing their narration, not narration, illustration, like history illustration. She did doodles and I did a big black E and she stamped E's on here. We cut up a paper with E. She's struggling on E. That's why we've done E for the past two weeks. So, um, I make lines on here and then I make an E or whatever letter with the highlighter. And then she goes through and traces it. And also we're working on her name. So, she traced Marley. Oh, no, she didn't trace that. But, so, this is what our main, we're just working on writing M and A. And another thing, I started putting dots to show her how to trace it, and then here she knows how to start and go about doing that. So now we're, this is what we did yesterday. Traced her name, we trace her name every day. And then yesterday, instead of doing our E's, we just kind of did a review, and so today I will do it. Another M-A for her name, and probably do D, E, and F. Oh, yeah, I'll do that. Just to introduce it. So, that's our plan for today. All right, so I recorded me and Marley working on all the things we had to do today. And then when I went back to review it, it was, um, you saw Marley and then you saw like this area. <laughs> so I don't want to be like all up cleavage all up in your face. So I'm just going to take you and walk through what we did instead of showing you. Sorry. All right. The first thing that we did, I have a sentence strip with her name on it. And then clothespins, Marley, Marley, 
with letters. So since we're just working on her M and A for now, she just takes them and she clips it on. I can't do it with one hand, but she clips it on there and matches them up. So when we get to R, I'll add the R onto this. So that's usually how we start. And then I get her notebook out. And today you would have seen me, but they said it didn't work out. Where am I? Okay, this is what we did these two today. So I'm like, I get my black marker and I draw say top line, bottom line, broken line. And then I, with the highlighter, I write the M and the A while I'm telling her how it written and then she traces it with a marker or a pencil or whatever and then she wrote it by herself and then I did the same with the ENF and I introduced F and we talked about F and let's see if I can get her to tell you. Hey Marley, what kind of sound is F? Is it a throat noise? Do it. Can you show me what a throat, how you tell? What do you got in your mouth? Becky stuff? Mm -hmm. Which one is cow? Oh, well, I don't know why you have crown in your mouth. Mm. Yes. Yeah. No. Do it, go. No. Can you feel it? No. Is it a chin sound? No. No. Is it a mouth sound? Yeah. Yes. You can feel it. Yeah. We did feathers. Do it. Go. Yeah. <laughs> when you do it correctly, yes. You can, the feather moves. When you show it's a mouth noise. Alright, and that's what we did. And we just talked about F a little bit. I didn't want to do too much with F. We introduced it today. Yes, that's right. Do it again. I get Guys, so you, it can move. See, guys? Mm hmm Yeah. Yeah. Don't put it in your mouth, though. So, because uh, we did need to finish up our E, so I got this out, and we, she traced the E's, and if I can put this focus, she traced these three, and then she wrote one by herself, which she did amazing, and she did these little E's, and she said, she was like, I can't do it, and then she did it. She wrote it by herself, a perfect E. Then we traced, found the E's in the pictures, and then traced it with our fingers. And then I write her name in the highlighter, and then she traces the whole thing. Just to introduce all the other letters in her name. Marley. And then, my papa. Thank you. There's brown that was in your mouth. And then she just did this paper. So we went through the colors. She knows her colors, but we just reviewed it. And she traced it. Well, tempted. She gave up then. And I'm not pushing her to finish it because we did a lot of tracing today. And that is it. Besides, you know, she'll probably go on ABC Moss for a little bit today and do a lesson on that. And that's all she did. Now she's gone and going to the other room.